Plugins are powered by third-party applications that are not controlled by OpenAI. ChatGPT plugins are add-ons you can pair with the AI chatbot to extend its capabilities. These are available through the ChatGPT plugin store. ChatGPT plugins only work with the GPT-4, which gives the chatbot access to the internet. You need a ChatGPT Plus subscription to install a ChatGPT plugin. Upgrade to ChatGPT Plus, hover over GPT-4 and click on Upgrade to ChatGPT Plus. Click on Upgrade to Plus and follow the purchase steps. Turn on ChatGPT plugins. By default, access to the plugins is disabled. You can turn on ChatGPT plugins in Settings. In the bottom right corner, click on your account name. Click on Settings and Beta. In the settings menu, click on beta features. Enable the plugin's toggle button and close the window. Now you can use the version that knows when and how to use third-party plugins that you enable. Install plugins. In the GPT toggle switch, hover over GPT-4 at the top. There is a drop-down that allows you to switch between the standard and plugin-powered version of GPT-4. Select plugins beta. The ChatGPT plugin mode is now enabled. You will see a text drop down telling you how many plugins are currently enabled, which should be none at this moment. Click on No Plugins Enabled beneath the GPT mode toggle. Click on Plugin Store. A list of available plugins is displayed. There are two ways to find new plugins. Browse or search for ChatGPT plugins by keyword. You can browse all new and popular ChatGPT plugins. Or you can use the search to find plugins by keyword. Note that the search results only return plugins with the exact keyword in the plugin name or description. Plugins with the similar names or functionality are not included. For example, let's search for a plugin for Paraphrasing. When you enter paraphrase without the E at the end, two plugins are displayed. But once you enter paraphrase or paraphrasing, only one plugin is displayed. If you can't find a plugin, try searching for related keywords or types of functionality. Install plugins. You can install one or more plugins by clicking on the install button next to plugin. When you click on install, two things could happen. The plugin installs instantly or you may be redirected to a third-party website to create an account to use the service with the ChatGPT. For example, the Notable app redirects you to create an account and asks you to authorize ChatGPT with your account. Click on Install, Login or Create a new account. Once the app is installed and connected to any necessary third-party accounts, you can use the plugin in ChatGPT. Repeat this process for every plugin you are interested in. Click on X to exit the store. Enable plugins. Once installed, you must enable the plugins to use them. Click on the drop-down. You will see the list of plugins you have installed. To enable the plugin, Click on the check mark next to the plugin. You can only have three plugins enabled at any time. ChatGPT will not allow you to enable the fourth one. To disable any plugin without uninstalling it, just uncheck the box next to the plugin. Now the enable plugin icons are displayed instead of the text for the plugin drop down. Uninstall plugins. Click on the drop down, scroll down and click on Plugin Store. Click on Installed. Find the plugin you want to uninstall and click on Uninstall. Earth plugin is enabled. You can also uninstall an enabled plugin. ChatGPT plugins are powerful but be picky. While OpenAI reviews plugins for usage that goes against its usage policies, it's up to you to research third-party ChatGPT plugins before giving them access to your data or credit card. A quick 
web search for most plugins will result in an official website, media mentions or directory listings with more details. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.